Hey guys, welcome to Friday Update. Okay, so I got some big news. But before I get into it, let me tell you about my week. Okay, so on Sunday, I drove all the way to and from Fayetteville. To visit my Uncle Ross and Aunt Pam because we had to drop off some coffee for them because I like to drink coffee. And it was great to see them again. Although I did hope that we got home in time before it was too late. Mainly because I was tired as hell. And throughout the week, it's been pretty good. Just a few bumps in the road. And... And all that. Well, anyway, on to... My big news. The girl I've been talking about, this, whenever I say, oh... The girl I like, the girl I like, the girl I like. Yeah, um, I'm over her now. And hopefully I'll get to tell her. But the thing is, it's usually easy to tell someone that you've liked for so long that you're finally over them. Usually they you have a better chance of them actually believing you when you like somebody else. But the thing is, I don't like anyone else right now. So, I'm kind of like... in a pickle. And the thing is, with the girl I liked before, this girl... Anastasia, with her and the girl before that, Taylor Dufresne, it was, it was basically easy to say, hey, you're not my crush anymore, because, because I've established, because at that point I had established that I had a new crush, so, but this girl, it's different because I have not not liked somebody since well after my first love Laura that I've already explained what happened with her and then and so it's kind of hard I don't know how I can say to her to this girl hey, I'm over you without sounding like an asshole. And to say it in a way that it makes sense that because I'm under a lot of pressure. And some of you might be thinking, oh, but her, you and her are just really good friends and all that. Well, to tell you the truth, I got over her because I just can't put her through all this stuff anymore. Anytime I go on Snapchat saying, oh, I'm really, really sad, I feel worthless and all that. Here's the thing. Anytime I put anything on Snapchat, she's usually one of the people that always views it. After she rejected me, because of the whole Valentine fiasco, which I've already explained isn't actually what you, what you think it is. Hold up. I posted on Snapchat saying, after being depression free for however long, all that is down the drain. I saw that somebody had viewed it, and I scrolled up, and it was a girl. But I would have messaged her saying, hey, it's not what you think. It's because at that point, Stephanie had only been dead for a week and a half. So 
so yeah. I'm impressed with the whole rant I did on why I've been single for so long. She viewed it and it really hurt her feelings. Basically stuff like that. I just can't put her through this anymore. But in the meantime, while well, I do figure out how I'm going to tell her, I'll be focusing on my mental health. I'll be focusing more on what can I do to take care of my other issues. What can I do to make myself feel better about myself? What can I do so that this from just a couple nights ago, believe it or not, this did not come from my rabbit. Oh yeah. I need to think about myself. First. I need to take care of my issues first. In fact, this was brought to my attention last night when I was talking to Isabel. And Isabel brought up a good point saying that it's best I focus on other things before I take care of this. So that way... Mainly because she knows that I'm dreading having, this converse, having that conversation with her. With, with this girl. Because I just... Don't want to screw it up. And I've already screwed up a lot of things. And I'm not saying that our friendship is going to go except going to go back to way to how it was before all this started. Because that will take a lot of time and adjustment. But at least this is a start. So yeah. That's my big news. And in regards to this, I'm actually feeling a lot better now than I did when I did that. I don't even know what triggered it, to be honest. But... But anyway... That's all for Friday Update. I'll see y'all next time. And when I do get around to talking to this girl, I'll let y'all know. And, uh... Please, no advice. I want to figure out how to do this by myself. I want to be able to get past this on my own. Anyway, so I'll see y'all. This concludes Friday Update. See you next Friday. Stay awesome, everyone.